Well, well, well. Here we go again. The second part of to my racist as hell series. This time we're gonna get into injustice too. And just how they whitewashed a lot of the characters from the Bible and from past history and turned them to a lot of these uh, comic book characters, but all of them are literally white. Do you look like it just, if you look at Injustice 2, it looks like it's snowing outside and it's so damn white. So let's go into this. This is Bass Root. This is the real Lone Ranger. I might have butchered that name, but this is the real Lone Ranger. He's a black man. Him and Tonto um, worked at Indian territories that a lot of the white sheriffs were scared to, to work. He was a genius. He was unbeaten in a gun battle. He was so cold, he brought his own son in. Now, as we look at Superman, this Lily White character who is based off Samson that's why they got the S and the M in there you do your geometry homework you'll see what that's about I'm not here to get into geometry and all that though so you look at Batman and you look at Robin you look at these characters who Batman is actually based off of a demon they keep bringing him back and bringing him back and bringing him back in different forms for all for thousands of years they've been showing this character so and then you got the Amazon woman she's an Amazon she wasn't white. She wasn't white. She was an Amazon. So they based her off of the Amazon, off of a whole people of color, but they make her lily ass white. Now this ain't all this is about, cause uh, there's a lot of uh, ethnic characters in the DC. Why is Injustice 2 just going lily ass white on us, man? Lily ass right. You got Robin, you got all these characters. Black History Month just passed and we didn't get one black character revealed. I mean, damn, I mean, Cyborg is 10% uh, black, I guess. I guess it's his kid is black, but he's mostly robot. Then you got Aquaman, the king of Atlantis. <laughs> so when Atlantis was going, there was no white people on the earth. The first recorded white man was Esau, recorded in the Bible. There was no white men even on the earth. But they want to sell to a bunch of black people. They want to sell to a bunch of Mexican people. They want to sell to a bunch of people of Asia. But they don't want to put none of them in there. Because it's still a mind fuck. White man is all powerful. If you go put Captain Cold in, who's a character I like, don't get it twisted. This is a game that I actually liked. I'm getting older. I stopped playing games. Then they announced this. I'm like, uh-oh. <laughs> you know? But it's racist as hell. Captain Boomerang, all these characters they name, not one of them of color. So we're about to start getting to some uh, different characters like Apache on your left. Then you got uh, Black Lightning in the middle. Then you got Samurai. Now these are their newer versions and whatnot. This is another thing too though, I have to explain to you. And I believe, I can't remember the, uh, the Spanish dude's name, but he may be Aztec. But another thing I got to explain to y'all, this is also being marketed to 18 and 19 year olds. If you're looking for some nostalgia, this ain't your game. Now, here goes Black Man, and one of the most requested, they even put him as a stage transition. He is a brother, but no, they couldn't put him in the game. Um, here goes Apache Chief, one of the greatest characters in DC for me. I mean, they was he, on the Super Friends, the Justice League. There's only a, a few people out of a thousand characters, and he was one of them. You know, and he was made because there wasn't enough ethnicness. And back in the days, people were smart enough to not watch um, something if their color's not being represented. Now, here's Black Vulcan. He was introduced. He's actually a, a Hanna-Barbera character that was introduced because they couldn't get the license for Black Lightning on Super Friends. But he's a good character, too. Can we get Black Lightning to Black Vulcan? Can we get somebody of color? He doesn't even have to be black. Man. I mean, I just want somebody of color. He goes Icon, somebody they don't touch. Icon's story is he was an alien flying over and he seen a plantation and he admired those people that was working on the plantation so hard and he transformed himself into a Negro, you know, in other words, true Jew, and uh, took on that form. So they could have put him, I'm just saying. Uh, there's going to be another video dropped. I just had to drop this real quick for the sunset. Here goes Samurai, man. Why don't you guys do him? I mean, he's not even a brother. He's a Japanese guy. What? Japanese don't buy the game? Even though it's the 
the second biggest market after America, they're not buying the game? Uh-huh, okay, okay, well, they don't need to be represented. Vando Savage, on the show he was a white boy, but he really ain't a white boy. You could have put some Vando Savage in it, man. I just want to say, uh, Injustice 2 is, is racist. racist as hell.